everybody it's mike with the mountain weekly news welcome back to quick hits of the day today i am out testing the gilson homebrew 160 snowboard this is a camber dominant snowboard and actually under the middle of the board it is completely flat not only that gilson's got all sorts of weird tech going on talked about this in their boards before but if you look right below the edges it's actually a little it seems like it's a little less material it doesn't make contact with the snow at all times so you're actually riding this board more on the middle of the board uh, the middle of the base so it gives it a really nice kind of rock back and forth um, and then again with that dominant camber profile you can really load this board up really really nice for sending airs uh, it's kind of a warm day today the board is just flying and uh, super stoked if you want to learn more about Gilson snowboards check out the podcast I did with their founder Nick Gilson the snowboard industry really didn't support these guys but man he's uh, he, he did it on his own they're uh, based in Michigan I believe and uh, yeah these boards are popular and popular for a reason and they are direct to consumer so that is the quick hits short of the day